welcome back everyone to another tutorial on tableau this series of videos will help you take your skills from beginner to expert level in tableau do not forget to hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon so that you are the first one to know whenever i upload any new video in today's session we will see how to create a filter reset button in tableau to clear all the filters that we have on the dashboard with just one button click let me first show you the demo of what we will be doing today here i have a dashboard that shows sales of different subcategories then here i have a view that shows segment wise profit and here are the few filters that i have added on the dashboard let me put filters on this dashboard i'll select office supplies and technology under category filter then i will deselect accessories appliances and let me also put filter on the state click apply now to reset these filters we will have to go on each of the filter individually either click here to reset the filter or select all from the drop down so a workaround here is that i have created this reset filters button and with a single button click we will be able to reset all these filters let me put some filters again deselect furniture then deselect accessories art subcategory click on apply then from state let me deselect few states click on apply now when i will click on this reset filters button you will observe that all the filters will reset and the views will also reset to the default state by clicking on this reset filters button we were able to reset all the filters instead of going to each of the filter individually to reset it we can just click on this single button now let's jump to tableau and see how to create this filter reset button first we will create a calculated field so click on the drop down click on create calculated field let's name it reset button here within single quotes write down reset this reset text will appear on the button that we will add on the dashboard you can write anything here that you want to display as text click on okay now under marks type select shape drag this reset button calculated field that we have created to shape change the fit to entire view now let's edit the shape let me select the reset icon that i have added to the tableau repository this reset icon so this is the custom shape that i have added to the tableau repository i have already created a video where i have discussed how to add custom shapes in tableau you will find the link of that video on the top right corner and i have also added the link of that video in the description below now click on okay we want the reset text to appear just below this icon so drag this reset button calculated field to label we want this reset text to come below this icon so go to label then click on this alignment drop down from here select center and here select bottom let's also increase the font size from the drop down let's select 12 click anywhere outside lastly we do not want any tool tips so click on tool tip and uncheck show tool tips click on okay now we don't see any tool tips here we have created a reset button 
now we will add this reset button sheet to the dashboard so go back to the dashboard add this sheet let's hide this title right click and click on hide title now last step is to create filter dashboard action that will help us to reset all the filters by just clicking on this single button go to the dashboard click on actions here we will add filter action let's name it reset filters source sheet will be the reset button sheet that we have created run action on select under target sheets we will select all the sheets on which the filters will work so that once you click on reset button then the applied filters will be removed from all those sheets so untick sheet 1 from here clearing the selection will show all values and here we will select all the fields used as filter in the worksheet and which you want to reset once the reset button is pressed let's see what all filters we have added to the dashboard click on ok click on ok again we want these category subcategory and state filters to reset once we click on this reset button so let's edit the dashboard action again click on actions select this reset filters action click on edit and here we will add all the fields category then we will add subcategory and last will be state you will get this warning message missing fields on sheet 1 which we can ignore click on okay click on okay again now let's add some filters to this dashboard so let's uncheck appliances accessories art binders click on apply then let's uncheck alabama florida georgia now you will notice that when we will click on this reset button then all the filters will reset and the views will also reset to the default state without any filters applied let's click on this reset button so now you will observe that all the filters are reset and the views have also reset to the default state one thing you will notice here is that when you select the button the button is getting highlighted to remove this highlighting we can do one additional step so go back to the sheet create a new calculated field let's name it remove highlight and you can write anything here within single quotes let's write remove highlight click on okay now add this new calculated field to detail go back to the dashboard now we will add one more filter action go to the dashboard go to actions from the drop down select filter let's name it remove highlight source sheet will be the reset button sheet that we have added to the dashboard run action on select and the target sheet will be the reset button sheet and not the dashboard clearing the selection will show all values click on selected fields we will add a filter source field will be the remove highlight field that we have created and target field can be any field click on okay click on okay again 
let's add some filters again uncheck accessories uncheck art uncheck envelopes click on apply let's add some filters to the state click on apply now to reset all the filters we can click on this reset button and you won't see any highlighting around this button last thing we can add a background color to this reset button worksheet so that it matches with all these filters so right click click on format click on shading let's select this gray color click anywhere outside you can also adjust the size of this icon according to your requirement let's decrease the size of this icon a little bit go to the sheet go to size just decrease the size a little bit go back to the dashboard now the view looks good so in this way we can create a reset button that will help user to reset all the filters by just clicking a single button and no need to go to each individual filters to reset it so this was all that i had to cover in this session i have added the link of this workbook in the description below thanks for watching this video do not forget to hit the like button if you like this session see you in the next tutorial